Hey guys, I will show you how to fix this problem quickly and effectively. In the first step, simply go to search bar, type here CMD, then right click here and select run as administrator. Select S. On this window, we need to execute some commands. So type all these commands carefully and hit enter to execute them. In the first step, we need to type here GP update and hit enter. So this process will take few seconds to complete the you know uh, all the processes and once done we will move to the next command that will be PROMPT prompt and hit enter now type here CHK DSK and hit enter again this command will take few seconds to complete the process we need to wait for it and so it's done type your sfc space slash scan file equal to c colon backslash windows backslash system32 backslash ie frame dot dll and hit enter now type your sfc space slash verify file equal to c colon x slash windows slash 1632 slash ie frame dot dll so these all commands are very important to fix this issue so please do all the commands and execute them hit enter now simply type your sfc space slash scan now and hit enter so this command will take around 10 to 15 minutes depends upon your computer configuration how fast it is so we need to complete this up to the hundred percent so we will run this in the background till then we will complete the next method simply right click on the start icon go to device manager and expand display adapters right click on the particular drive or device select properties now go to drivers tab and click on update driver we need to select this option search automatically for drivers we need you can also uh, make sure you are connected with your internet connection then check this option and the best drivers will be installed automatically now close this window again expand monitors if you uh, if you have these uh, option on your system then expand monitors right click on the particular device open its properties go to driver tab and click on update driver now select this option and the best drivers will be installed automatically now close all windows one by one complete this up to the hundred percent and after that close this window and simply restart your system and your problem will be solved for sure you can also check out our description link to fix this issue quickly and effectively. And yeah, don't forget to like the video. Please do subscribe to the channel.